Yo, what's up everybody? The Jenner Garage coming to you live from the workshop. The workshop is the trailer. Well, we didn't have a race on Friday. Got rained out Burbank, so gonna lose a video there, but figured I can uh, start this coming up week's video now. Got back, seen some footage of the race. Um, obviously I was fighting something all day long. I just felt like I was loose. Um, I've got an older chassis, so we'll run pills. So when I want to make a camber adjustment, I have to pill it with the, you know, up, down, how much, you know, I want to get with the spacer. Probably have some of them here. But um, I went from all the way in, as small as I can get it, all the way to middle, all the way other. And then I turned the other one around and got maximum. And I still was chasing tire wear on my front right. Um, you guys seen in the video, I got in the accident Friday. Everything looked good. I was chasing this. It was, it, it may have already been a little bit of bent or the pill pilling was off. Um, Cause the weekend prior at Fruitland, I was chasing tire wear. I was actually taking notes of it. I don't have my notebook here with me now, but I was taking notes of it. I was probably only using 80% of my tire two weeks ago. And then this past week I was using around 80. I kind of thought I was getting 85 and that's just where it was kind of cuffed over the edge. You know, I wish I had. So I was only getting hard to see here, but you know, like this much of my tire you know from the inside was getting worn and i was not getting that full 100 percent 100 percent equal script i'll probably enter some photos now where you can kind of see but basically was riding cambered up like this so this outside two three inches wasn't getting anything blah 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 long story short spindle definitely been up um not sure if we have a tail here but if you look there's a gap you can see this bottom here i'm uh I don't have much space. This bottom, I believe, kind of seat up. I'll take it off and I'll measure, but I'm I'm gonna I'm pretty sure that the distance between here and here is smaller than here and here, and that's due to the fact this L went up. So I'm gonna take it off. Um, I've I've got good. Uh, I got a good. I'm optimistic that I can get it straight. Um, can I? I don't know, but I can definitely see what I can do. Being that it's an older cart, I might have a hard time finding a new replacement. I'll give the guys up at TS a call tomorrow. Uh, Raymond, awesome dude. Um, very knowledgeable, been around for a long time. Um, started parts out of the back of his truck at Freeland. So, trust his opinion. Um, always chat with him. I'll call him, talk to him about it. Hopefully, he's got one. Um, yeah. If not, this fabrication work might, uh, might have to work. I'll get this pulled off. We'll look at it. All right. We got the spindle out. Um, not sure if you can tell, but it's definitely more of a C than a U. If that makes sense. Also got a noticeably bent spindle arm, as well as this bearing is done. I'll show you what we did. If we can get some lights going. We're in there like swimwear, that's what they say, right? All right, uh, lightning bolt part. Straighten her out. Put a fresh coat of paint on her. Spindle was good. Replaced the bearings. Capped them, packed them. We uh, just straightened old girl out. Uh, I wish I could have got a new caster. This is this is a caster knuckle, caster uh, caster block. Thank you, Ryan Blair, for that. Good friend of mine raced back in the day. Informed me that that is a caster block. We're learning every day. We're learning every single day. Um, gonna get it bolted up, check it out. See if I can get it true. I don't know how well I can check in the trailer. We'll see. All right, I got distracted. We'll pick this back up at the track. Uh, I got the tire, everything mounted up. I've, I've, I've reached out to the powers within, um, trying to get some advice. I'm still, I've got the biggest hill in, so I've got it, if it were to be straight, as far out as I can. And I've, I've still got some uh, 
still got a good amount of camber so we're gonna run with it if anything i can lower the psi and make it work minute but uh decided to come out and see how the spindle does a little bit of tire prep yesterday and a little bit today the track looks very uh very loose just watch the guys practice i didn't go out for practice we're gonna go straight into the heat just kind of keep my spot i think i explained last time out here i am was third i am now second in points so two people that are in front of me even though i finished fourth i still jumped up because they weren't here uh, one of the guys, I think he was in fourth or fifth, he leapfrogged me. He is now in first. I'm only behind him at uh, 30 points. Pretty good sized gap. All right, last Second, call the third. For so, just try to get the points, fill out the cart, use it for uh, research and development. We'll uh, get some footage. Here. time Fisher able to hold on to the lead but here comes Smith now fighting back on the bottom into turn three Smith takes the lead a little bump there up and out of the groove now it's gonna be a three card race here comes the 108 of Bishop oh no and Bishop goes around that's some good racing going on there that's gonna bring out our caution here we were able to get a lap in that time And Bishop has climbed out of his cart and going to voice a little bit of displeasure there. Uh, Again, we need Junior One and Predator we're to, headed up, to the grid. We're headed up for the feature pretty soon. Um, I'll let you guys be the judge of that footage. Definitely feel like I got pinned down below and I had plenty of nose in there that I seen him, he should have seen me. Uh, he, he had maybe a, a nose on me going in and just pinned me down in the, uh, in the tire. Um, like I said, I'll let you guys be the judge of that. Footage is there. We'll move on. Uh, I thought I was starting last. There's 11 cards in the feature. Ninth, starting ninth. So uh, we'll see if we can make our way up. Hopefully we get a couple cautions, get a couple passes early. Cart was fast. I felt good going out. Uh, made a slight gear change. The track looks like it's coming in pretty nice. Uh, hopefully we can get a little quicker. Cleaning tires, prep tires, worked on that knuckle the whole time, to be honest with you. Um, spindle looks good. Um, I guess the spindle is actually what bent. The spindle itself is straight, and then where it crosses into the caster block is straight, but where the uh, where the other piece is is what broke. Um, tie rod and connector, tie rod and arm, I don't know. There's some terminology. If you guys know it, uh, drop it in the comment section below. But Rework that, a little bit of hitch, right, a little bit of vice, a little bit of hammer, and uh, see what she does. Hopefully she drives straight. Uh, steering's a little off, but and we should manage to get out. a couple points. Uh, hopefully we can find our way to the front. Enjoy.
start making their way to the staging area. All right, that was a rough one. Uh, started off bad, ended bad. Got a lot of work to do tomorrow for the big race, the fruit win money race. Um, obviously, what I try to do with the knuckles, fixed it. Just the alignment's completely out of whack. Um, super loose, I had nothing. Sucks because the car was fast, gearing was good, tire prep felt good. I just had nothing consistent steering. Um, and now that I look at it, now that I got time to sit down, I, I can see where I was wrong. So we'll, we'll pull the body off tomorrow before the race and get everything square. I got a level, I got to do it old school and try to get everything as true as I can that way. Oh, um, not sure how much you can tell. But it's bad. I also got into uh, one of the guys pretty hard coming in inside of him. Uh, he came down on me and had a flashback from when I had that cut down out of Burbank. I haven't got a video of that, but ate up the Vega pretty good. She holds holds air. I'll hold it as a spare. It sucks because that was a good tire still. Had had some life left in her. I'm gonna have to find another. There we go, Professor Vega. Clutch Junior Three Division. Eight lap feature coming up. But uh, we're ending the video Smith off here. Start on the pole. We got tomorrow eight. morning. Tomorrow's video. Nine Probably be posted purple. later in the. Uh, Later in the week at Fruitland Park, the dash for well. cash. Right now the pot's 350 bucks. I'm hearing rumors that it should four. go as high as uh, 450, if not more. I uh, hear someone's putting another 50, and then another person's gonna put another 50 bounty on. So it'll be a lot of fun. Hopefully I can get this card lined up, set up right. Um, every week's a new challenge.